teaching with technology. Some of the ways that the technology then is utilized by teachers to enhance their teaching. One is content management, using a framework such as Moodle to put up their assignments, uh, web resources, whatever they find uh, that they may want to share with their students. Classroom management, they're using Power Teacher as an electronic gradebook. Um, they can get attendance statistics, mm -hmm. find parents' uh, home phone numbers, mailing addresses, so on and so forth. And we've started rolling out a new product called Impera, which every teacher that has it is just thrilled with it. What it allows them to do is view a thumbnail of every computer being utilized by a student in their classroom. So they can see what the child's doing. They can broadcast what they're doing out to all the computers in the classroom. They can open a web link and then push it out to all the students in the classroom. They'll open the web browser for it on the student computer and take them to the website that the teacher wants them to go to. Direct Ac Access 2012, I'm very excited about this. We started a pilot with uh, 12 combination administrators and teachers. What this is, is a transparent virtual private network connection. What's that mean? All it means is teachers will have the exact experience at home that they have at school, which will allow them to access all their file shares, all of the resources that they have when they're at school, they can now access from home. And the beautiful thing is they do nothing. It just happens in the background. So they take their computer home, and it's no different if they had it sitting in their, in their, uh, on their desk in their classroom. So that alleviates a lot of the issue with trying to transfer files back and forth, carry a thumb drive, so on and so forth. Um, some of the things that are inherently bad is from a security perspective. So we're excited. The first 12 people that have been using it, um, so far so good. So we're going to continue to start rolling out and getting more and more teachers involved. We still want to take it slow just to make sure there aren't any gotchas out there that we have.